And what's up, everybody? It's your boy Oops, and I'm back again, once again. How y'all doing today? What's going on, my friends? It's your boy Uj back in, like I said. And uh, we got chapter 80 this time around. Happy New Year, by the way, if you're coming from the last chapter, 79, which came out at the very end of 2021. This is Gas vs. Granola Part 2. Of course, the fight is continuing from the last part. Again, if you missed out on last month's chapter reaction, please go ahead and check that out. I'll obviously be uploading these every year. And for whatever reason, if you're new to the channel, Obviously, the quick plugs, make sure you are liking, sharing, subscribing, hitting the bell for all alerts on when I upload to this channel. So without further ado, guys, don't want to waste too much of your time. Let's just get right into it. Okay, so rule of thumb really quick. Um, I will have, you know, a uh, very, very minute display, obviously, as you can see on the screen in front of you. And I will, I guess, show off some nice pages when those pages come, but I obviously can't have them all huge because of obvious reasons so let's get into it oh okay so we're starting off with some screaming mm, powering up i'll figure out what i'll figure out that move soon enough and he's trying to come crashing down punching the ground trying to make some kind of eruption come through charges that gas oh, i'm sorry you know charge that granola excuse me i'm getting my character's names switched up yo did did he just shoot eyes, laser beams out of his eyes too? What's going on? Oh, damn! Granola out here just dodging. Gas is just throwing everything at him. Take this. Going back and forth. Gas is just or granola just uh, dodging and avoiding gas altogether. Wait a minute. Granola just did some move where he's like, he has all the rocks around gas and he like does one of these Gara Johns. And did he just make the rocks explode? Like what, what's going on here? Okay. So he comes down, kicks gas. Gas is taking a little bit of damage. Gas might be stronger, but he's losing in the skills department. Dang, guess those Dragon Balls ain't all that after all. Hang on, guys won't let it end like this. Okay, so he's definitely gonna have something else up his sleeve. So whether that's a transformation, power up, or what have you, we'll we'll definitely see from here on out. So they're now they clash in, they're meeting. I can, I can now track your every move. Okay, so it looks like gas is finally catching on. Vegeta goes, damn it, granola wasted too much time and allowed gas to grow a, accustomed to those new moves. Yeah, so it's 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 really weird how they're they're doing it, but this is basically just you know the the uh, you know the obvious pretty much. It's like a Dragon Ball trope at this point. It's just like when you have something new, you have to you know kind of get used to it. And uh, I mean, within minutes, it seems like they're already used to it. So <laughs> okay, so Granola gets. Hit back, guys. Like I won't lose sight of you again. But, but they're still going back at e they're they're still going at each other, like trading blows. Granola gets a kick in again. He gets behind them, gets another kick in. Oh wow! So it's almost like he's doing like shadow clones, low key. Actually, yeah, it really does look. It, it's coming off like he is doing that. Now he's shooting some more finger guns. Boom, boom, boom. Goku goes relax. Granola still has the skills to win this thing. So right now, it is basically just Goku and Vegeta are just the cheerleaders, which I don't mind at all so far. Uh, but Gas comes in with a gut check. Ooh, ooh, oh. Knocks down Granola. Granola, oh, he's feeling it. He has dug up right into the stomach again. Gas goes, making clones splits your power. How idiotic. Uh, good awareness on that one. Gas says, this last move of yours was all or nothing then. Oh, snap. So, okay, I'm going to show you guys this one because this one's actually kind of OD. Check this one out. So, he's doing like an all finger beam attack to take out every single granola clone. So, all these granola bars are hitting the can right now that's kind of uh ridiculous oh and they're all gonna die you can definitely tell by like the little swirly johns in the background it's like, that's like a given like manga effect uh one that's definitely used a lot in uh dragon ball granola or gas says you got lost in the power of those skills granola but hold on there's one more that he missed 
or I was just waiting for this perfect opening. And he goes, ah, oh, shoots him clean in the stomach. And he takes that whole hit and Granola did not look, well, sorry, Gas did not look like he was ready for it. it look, at, look at this man's face. I got to show you all this one right here real fast. Look at his face. You tell you, 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 you think this is a face of, oh, like I definitely saw that coming hell to the no. Are you kidding me? Get that shit out of here. My man getting bought, crashes back into a bunch of rocks, mountains, water, more land. Damn. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on. But wait a minute. I don't think it's over because it looks like granola. Or I'm sorry. It looks like gas is sinking in whatever like body of water that he's in right now and i'm not gonna lie we've seen this in plenty of times in anime usually when that happens that normally means that they're about to emerge from that john and come up with some crazy new power up or whatever so i'm expecting that so that's a prediction i guess i have so let's see what happens so granola comes out goes and goku goes way to go vegeta says wait what's wrong with granola Goku, oh no, Vegeta says, any damage taken by the clones is felt by his real body? That final ploy was a sacrificial one. Oh, so he took all that damage to us. I guess that's kind of fair, right? Here comes, uh, Monaito, Granola. Stay back, it's not over yet. Oh, so he felt it. Oh, okay, so, okay, so my prediction was wrong right off the bat because they got gas out the water. And then they go, come on, stay with us. Uh, oh, here comes Elik. What's wrong, Gas? This isn't like you. And then I guess Granola senses him. Elik, he's here too. And then the chick says, Why is Gas getting his butt beat, Elik? You're sure you made that wish to turn him into the universe's strongest, right? Okay, here we go. Let's see the truth. Of course I did. Gas is undeniably the strongest fighter now. By a huge margin, in fact. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, so hold on. So he goes to reach for his head and he takes off the little headpiece that he that he's been wearing this entire time. Takes it off. Gas is like, huh? And then the chick's like, what gives? And then okay, then he goes, No point in being the strongest in the universe when all that precious power is sealed away. I know you can withstand it now so liberate that inner nature you're you sure man <laughs> this didn't turn out so hot 40 <gasps> nah is he gonna transform into some like beast he's like uh, uh. this is clearly a bad idea when our instincts are unleashed we lose all sense of self and he looks like endure it gas you're not the man you were back then. Bro, bro he's like a fu He's an ape. He's basically an ape. Look at this. Look at this right here. Yo, yo. This is crazy, dude. Oh my God. This is, I, I did, that is some shit I did not see happening. I didn't see this coming. I really didn't. So kudos. <clears throat> he's going crazy is that gas where do you find another power up and he oh man he's got tusks coming out his freaking head and shit and granola's like what is he uh oh manito's seen this before he goes that look i saw it with my own eyes 40 years ago and then but he's like what <gasps> when bardock had gas on the ropes he lost himself and turned into that he lost himself so that's his last resort so okay 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 all right time out time out time out time out, time out. so you mean to tell me that which by the way they still have not shown us this actual fight and i'm really hoping they don't hold out on us for that because i'm really dying to see the actual outcome and fight between Bardock and Gas those 40 years ago because they've been really talking about it a lot like how they used to mention Frieza a lot during this whole arc and I feel like they haven't been mentioning him obviously because I feel like they're gonna throw out that element of surprise and Frieza's gonna just show up at, out of nowhere at some point during this arc because of what I just said. Now when it comes to this fight between Bardock and Gas right I think that there's something 
happening here that they're obviously not gonna show us and it's weird because they're basically saying that bardock handled gas just fine no hidden power up no weird whatever no kaioken nothing crazy and when he had him on the ropes even back then he was supposed to be this really strong being or whatever known to be like awesome crazy stuff that's when he whipped this out and now he's whipping this out after he got wished to be the strongest in the universe okay so like there is a lot happening right now that i just unpacked and now i just have more questions so i i really need some freaking answers here okay so he goes after granola oh yeah he is a full-on broly mode son oh yo he oh he hit him with the hulk leg smash and you guys know what i'm talking about and i have to i have to I, i'm not gonna disrespect hulk and not you know give the man his flowers because obviously we know broly did it but who where did broly get it from okay my man is on some hulk shit anyway and gas is no stranger to that he must have watched the first avengers film as well because he's doing the freaking bomb 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 to freaking granola right now he's basically a drumstick holy shit he's getting tossed around thrown around right now oh yeah granola is hurting yo he's about to get squashed dude he's really on some broly shit yo he's putting him through the ground dude this is actually kind of crazy he okay no 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 okay you guys make 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 something out of this one okay right here he drives him so deep within the earth and then he they, they must have came out on the other side of that fucking mountain do you see like this is where they it started and now it's ending up over here that's actually kind of crazy and he's like Grah! dude he's he, he, he's dude he's he's on some broly shit bro like there's no other way to explain it like this guy this guy is 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 broly too he goes and she goes see he's gone and lost his mind again yo granola is granola is gonna get bopped i don't know how he's gonna oh punch to the face he definitely broke his fucking nose oh my god goku's like this is nuts granola's not gonna last much longer but he goes Hey, old man, how in the world did Barak defeat Gas when he was like that? Okay, if I turn this page, let me tell you guys something right now. If I turn this page, okay, and mind you, I really haven't been on social media all that much today at this recording because I had work and I've been busy pretty much editing and preparing for this event that I have going on this weekend. Cheap plug, follow me on Twitch you can follow and, and see exactly what's going on this weekend. In other words, I haven't seen anything, any talks about what's going on in this chapter. So if I turn this page right now and we finally get to see exactly what happened, if, if they show my man Bardock in the Ozaru and they start having the conversation about the tales, you heard it here first. Oh my god. I fucking hate them. Why? Why? They're really gonna they're gonna So we're never gonna know now. Okay, this this whole arc went from being OD to whack in a second. And leave it to Toriyama and Toyotaro to really just fucking blue ball us this entire time. Okay, whatever. My man said I was unconscious, I didn't see. Yo gas. Destroying stuff is great and all, but don't let the urge take over. Come back to your senses. This dude's like foaming of the freaking mouth. He's still like going crazy. Oh, he hit his com his companions. And he just drove himself into a mountain. What the fuck? Nope, he's lost his freaking mind. What now, Elik, huh? Gas is gonna wreck himself. It's fine. The universe's strongest warrior should have greater control over his own power than any other. <gasps> okay. Oh, he went right for Vegeta. Oh, bro. He must have been so fast. They couldn't even retaliate. He went right back. Goku and Manito. Vegeta, of course, getting the first kick. Oh, my God. Bro. Look at that. And then Goku comes in and goes, Vegeta! Goku tries to punch him. And then. Oh, hold on, hold on. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I might have to, take, I might have to eat my words. Hold on, hold on. So the second 
he dodges goku's punch and this is gas we're talking about gas looks back and I, I i i already know where this is going i'm not even gonna turn the page yet i know where this is going okay he's looking at he's looking at goku and he's probably gonna look at him and he's probably gonna think that it's bardo oh let's go oh my god oh my god oh snap damn look at yo look how tough my boy looks bro look at this jump right here oh yeah Ugh. my man bardock he's one of the, he's one of the he's one of the greatest free man look at that wow so bardock just handled him without even going like ape he didn't go ozaru really that's it really he handled him in that form in base nah 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 like well, hold on bardock got some aura maybe he, he got he got he got something what's going on here Oh, man, I ain't got... Oh, man, I need more answers. I don't know what the fuck they're doing with this damn story anymore. So, it looked like... Okay, so that's weird. So, it seems like Gas had, a, like, a traumatic memory that occurred. And it looked like he took the blast that Bardock hit him with 40 years ago. It looked like he took that shit now. Goku says, huh? And now he's, like, going crazy. He's kind of, like, acting all scared and shit oh whoa whoa okay what's happening elik go on gas remember you swore to never lose again right uh oh uh oh okay hold on i gotta show you all this because you already you already know what's about to happen look at this when when this shit happens the ch -ch, the ch okay when that shit happens you know it's about to go down okay hold on he's regaining his consciousness he regained his clothes he kept the tusks yes oh yo he kept the tusks can i i okay hold on hold on he said he says yes there you go goku says it looks like he's had some kind of awakening my little brother is the strongest in the universe for real now Go on, Gas. Annihilate those who stand in our way. Okay, so that's his brother? Okay, that's cool. But hold on, now I got a question, y'all. I have a question. I want to point something out here. Okay, now this is a little obvious. But, did Gas always have the black around his eyes? The answer is probably yes. Yeah, he, he kind of did. Okay, I'm not, all right, all right, all right, all right. I'm, I'm cool, I'm cool. Listen, 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 listen. I'm cool, all right, listen. This is the only thing that I want to really obviously bring to light here. Simply put, and it's going to be a while before we get to all talk about it on the Full Power Podcast because at the time of this recording, it didn't really line up with when we record our episodes because they do release on Fridays. So you'll hear us talk about it in episode 41 of the Full Power Podcast. And uh, yeah, so here's my thoughts right now, my immediate thoughts. And, and again, like I said, I we will elaborate and really dive into everything that happened in this chapter. A lot really did happen in this chapter. The most interesting that I am, I'm feeling off of this is that Gas is literally going through the motions of everything that I have straight up been calling out on for years the idea of the great apes the saiyans that are transformed into their ozaru forms when they regain their consciousness and they are able to control themselves they maintain a form while also maintaining that humongous source of power and what have i been calling that ladies and gentlemen i have been calling that primal instinct i've been calling that the new super saiyan 4 because honestly it doesn't matter what they call it but the idea and the concept is literally lining up and we are now seeing that with gas and yeah he's not a saiyan but the fact of the matter is is that this is a very similar concept because my man went straight broly Okay, and when Bro and I and I said this, I said, yo, if Broly had his fucking tail, I guarantee you he would have broken into that crazy amount of power in that monkey-like state. He would have done it without the freaking moon. 
and if there was to ever be a moment which i'm sure we'll get to in a future chapter or arc or whatever in this manga that it will most likely i feel like now it's gonna happen with it's definitely gonna happen with broly because after this fight you think goku's not gonna go back with broly and train and be like yo i fought a dude that had a similar power to you where he couldn't control nothing he had he was out of control and then once he regained his shit he was able to maintain it and look he even kept the tusks from what it looked like like you know like that the little head necklace that he had now it's just like it's like a part of him so whatever type of like race that these do the heater they're heaters right seem like they they might take on some i don't know i don't want to know if, i don't know if it's like elephant like or whatever but the whole point i'm trying to make is that now that he went in his crazy rage form now condensed it and into this controlled form while obviously it's implied that he's maintaining all that power he now also kept a new trait a new characteristic to his overall look now obviously i wanted to question the whole eyes thing i already debunked it right then and there he always had the dark uh eyeliner type look around his eyes the whole time it's not is this is not something new but again i'm just trying to draw the parallels to super saiyan 4 because that is what's gonna happen next eventually okay so those are my thoughts on the chapter overall obviously you could tell that i was pretty entertained and uh, very happy about what i read a lot of back and forth i thought things were gonna go a certain way and then you know it kind of turned around on me and then at the same time there was a couple things like yo i'm really mad that this man manito was knocked out and he didn't even see what happened during that fight so like i mean maybe if that's the only thing that we're ever gonna see out of that fight between gas and bardock from 40 years ago then that sucks but if that is all that we saw then it's just like then it's just like damn how did he fucking overcome this guy i mean maybe it was just one of those things where he just had gas kind of like defeat himself i don't know i don't know either way let me know you guys thoughts in the comments below like this subscribe hit me up on twitter all of that good stuff supporting links are always going to be in the description as always make sure you guys are taking care of yourselves may the power protect you keep it locked loaded right here on this channel Stay safe, stay clean, and stay inside. I'll see you guys 